dun, 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 dun. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Marilyn Darling Show. <clears throat> and welcome to another interview. Get too many things in my hands going all at once. Sorry, you guys, just give me a second. Hello, how are you? Are you having a nice day? I hope you're having a nice day wherever you are in the world. Today we are doing an ink review of Ferris Wheel Press Timeless Blue. And this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. <clears throat> the um, ink is a blue ink, and it has some gold or copper shimmer going on. Can you see that? That's pretty cool. I had it in a fine nib pen and I realized that I didn't like it in the fine nib pen so I put it in this here Noodler's Conrad and that is where we're at so far that's all I've done haven't done anything else haven't done any of the writing haven't done any of the water tests haven't done anything I was in a zoom call with Larry Fountain Pens so that was a lot of fun. Thank you, Larry, for inviting me. I really appreciate it. It's a lot of fun talking to all people about their top three fountain pens. Maybe soon I will make a top three fountain pens. I always hear these people talk about their Grail fountain pen. You know, their top, their number one Grail fountain pen. <clears throat> and sometimes it's really expensive, but sometimes it's not so expensive at all. My Grail fountain pen is right here, this Waterman 12 POC. It's wonderful, beautiful, bouncy fun, fun, fun pen. So, let's do this review. Take it in just a little bit. There, that should be good. <clears throat> so, this has some gold shimmer in it. You can kind of see it at the bottom. It's a little difficult to see, but... You guys can take my word for it. Now, where am I? I've got a, oh, now I'm all inky. Uh, I hate these. These stupid bottles that don't. Just use the white ones, you guys. Come on. I never have this problem with the white ones. Anyway, I'm complaining. Sorry. Wow, look at that. That is just fantastic. So I can marinate the comments. 
And then, I am not the most prepared today. Mm -hmm. Nice short day at work. Came home, got on a Zoom call. It was great. Now look at me. I'm all inky. Inky. <laughs> That's what it's all about, right? Okay, so. <clears throat> um, 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 what did I do with my brush pen? It's very nice. <clears throat> All right, what did I do with it, you guys? What did I do with the lid? Just had it five seconds ago. Get on the floor. For God's sake, I need a keeper. Someone to keep after my stuff. Ugh. I'll get to look at that in a minute. Just, just you wait. Hmm. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. See the little gold particles that are in the ink. It's really pretty. Just a second, you guys. Sorry. Um, 
there. That's a good one. Oh boy, I get to turn the page. Wow, that birthday cake is sure something, isn't it? <coughs> Hiya, Gary. How are you? Are you having a nice day? Me too. It has been a week. I am glad that it's Friday. Even though I'm practically going to be working this entire weekend, I have to do laundry. Laundry. The bane of my existence. And then I already went shopping, so that's good. I don't have to deal with that for a little while anyway. I went shopping before I got home. <clears throat> Today was a fairly short day. Today is Friday. I usually get out of the office about 2.30, maybe 3 o'clock. But you should come and join us over at Larry's Fountain Pens Zoom chat. <clears throat> we have a lot of fun talking about stuff. Bujo Saturday will be tomorrow. Yes. Tomorrow on time. Yes. 1 p.m. Pacific. And if I'm not on time, remind me. <laughs> One Anna, two Anna, three Anna, four Anna, five Anna. I think my clock is dying. Yes. If you don't have my phone number, it's on my profile. <clears throat> 
1N, 2N, 3N, 4N, 5N. Oh, cool. That doesn't take too long to get mail out these days. They've gotten much better at it, considering it takes took months and months to get one of my things in the mail. So. One Anna, two Anna, three Anna, four Anna, five Anna. <laughs> One Anna, two Anna, three Anna, four Anna, five Anna. One Anna, two Anna, three Anna, four Anna, five Anna. Cool. <coughs> I got some pre-owned pens that I'm going to do a re like a, a shootout with here very soon. One Anna, two Anna, three Anna, four Anna, five Anna. One Anna, two Anna, three Anna. Orion, I mean. One Anna, two Anna, three Anna. Orion, Fabiana. Pew, 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 pew. Okay, I will be right back. I am going to wash my hands and I will be right back. Two shakes. Sorry, I'm tripping over stuff over here. This room is too small, or I'm too fat. One or the other. And I'm not too fat, so shut up. <laughs> One 
Okay. <clears throat> yes, it is very, very saturated. It didn't even want to come off my skin. Thank God I bought bleach yesterday. I always, every day I have to wash my hands with bleach before I go to work. Because otherwise people will think I've been playing with a Smurf. I don't want anybody to think those thoughts. So. Ready? Okay. Let's take a look at our Nick Stewart technique. This looks very cool. This kind of reminds me <clears throat> of Columbia Blue Copper. I don't know where that one is at this moment. But that's that's kind of what it reminds me of. You can definitely see there's a little bit of sheen going on here. Some reddish copper sheen with some reddish copper shimmer going on. That is just re that just Reminded me of a thing, and we're not going to talk about it, but that is really cool. Okay. So, and then here is our ink swatch. <clears throat> I am really... I don't know if the word is congested today, but I'm very flummy. I'll say that. I'm very flummy. Okay, then we're going to take our little water drop test. One droppy drop, two droppy drops, three droppy drops, four droppy, oh, five droppy drops. We're going to give her a little swizzle. <clears throat> and then we'll do a toilet paper chromatography test. We'll get a brand new square. Brand new square. Alexa, stop. That is super cool. Can you guys see? There's like this pink thing going on. Super cool. Well, as we can see, this doesn't have very good water resistance. Maybe a teeny tiny bit, but I wouldn't chance it. Check out this toilet paper chromatography. No, that's really cool. There's some like purple that goes into blue, and then there's some pink in there. That's really pretty. Yes, Charmin toilet paper. No, actually, I think that this is um, Walmart brand. Great value, ultra strong. Because I just brought bought some Charmin and it was disappointing. Check out this, the top part of this. Oh my goodness. That's just sparkle, plenty. Doesn't even look like there was that much sparkle in there. But that is gorgeous. That's just fantastic. All right, well, we'll let this simmer over here some more. 
let's take a look at the paper test. All right, this is Pen and Gear Memo book from Walmart.com. Trying to get it to look like how it looks on 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 the paper. That's about how it looks. Okay, so look at that. There's lots of shimmer. No feathering. No bleeding. No ghosting. I would totally use the back side of this paper. Uh, Birmingham Pen Company 52 GSM to my river paper. I recently learned that they don't make this paper anymore, so that's too bad. Lots of shimmer. No feathering. Normal Tomoe River ghosting. I would totally use the back side of this paper. <coughs> Horia Dot Pad 80 GSM. Lots of shimmer. No feathering. No bleeding, no ghosting. I would totally use the back side of this paper. Okay. This is Fabriano Eco Qua 85 GSM. Hello, John Venus. How are ya? Are you having a nice day? I do not have any Visconti pens. No feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. I would totally use the back side of this paper. CVS caliber notebook paper. You can find this at CVS Pharmacy. Lots of shimmer, no feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. I would totally use the back side of this paper. Oh, exceed 100 GSM heavyweight paper. Looks nice, shimmer, no feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. I would totally use the back side of this paper. <clears throat> the Premier Premium Journal from the 99 cent store. Nice shimmer. Mmm, there's definitely looking a little feathery around these parts. Lots of bleed through, lots of ghosting. I would not use the back side of this paper. Claire Fontaine, 90 GSM. Where are we? Right there. Okay, can I have some books? Lots of shimmer, no feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. I would totally use the back side of this paper. Well, isn't the fact that I'm not a fan of Visconti? I just can't find a dealer that is near me that wants more than, that wants less than what I'm willing to pay for one. So yeah. <clears throat> This is the Lamy Booklet 90 GSM Quad Roll Paper. A uh, little bit of shimmer. Very nice. No feathering. 
No bleeding, no ghosting, I would totally use the back side of this paper. Unison Composition Book. You can find this at Target for 50 cents. Nice shimmer. No feathering. No bleeding. No ghosting. I would totally use the back side of this paper. Mead. Nice shimmer. Let's see. It looks like it's trying to feather, but it doesn't really feather out too bad. However, lots of bleeding, lots of ghosting. I would not use the back side of this paper. The writing tablet from shopischolar.com. You can find this at the Dollar Tree. It looks like it's trying to feather there, but that might have been my pen. I'm not sure. No, a little bit of no, little bit of ghosting right there. Little dots of bleed through. I would still use the back side of this paper. Hello, Fortun, for for Turkey. I keep wanting to call you Fortuna. <laughs> This is Express It Filler Paper. You can find this at the Dollar Tree. No, at the 99 cent store, sorry. It looks like it's trying to feather on the P and on the B a little bit. Yeah, a little bit of bleed through. I would not use the back side of this paper. What's a boon today? I don't know what that means. This is 32 pound Helid Packard 120 GSM copy paper. Nice shimmer, no feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. I would totally use the back side of this paper. Bay Fang Calligraphy Paper 74 GSM. Oh, it definitely looks like it's feathering on the F and on the W. It looks okay for the rest of it, but let's see. Yep, it did bleed through on the F, but it looks pretty good for the rest of it. If you use this in a fine nib, it'd be okay. So I would totally use the back side of this paper. All right, this is our ink of the day. Oh, pretty. Okay. Uh, whatever we want my blue. There it is. <laughs> I seem to have misplaced things. Um, I need a keeper. I need a keeper for all my things. Have this one. Oh dear. Okay. Well, I'm gonna put these in reverse order. So maybe I won't buy them. How are you guys doing? Are you having a nice day? I'm good. It's been a very nice day. Nice short day. Short days are always nice. Oh, I found them. Okay, good. All right, let's do some comparison, shall we? This is Ferris Wheel Press Timeless Blue. 
Diamine Blue Lightning. Diamine Aqua Lagoon. Diamine Steel Blue. KWZ. I'm sorry. Twisby Sky Blue. I don't know where my brain is right now. It's turned off. It's like it's the weekend. Robert Oster, Thunderstorm. I'll spread these out just a little bit. <coughs> you have Tremendous Black Blue, Noodlers, Blue Nose Bear, Sailor Manuel Haha, Monta Verde Blue Velvet Cake. Private Reserve DC Super Shell Blue, Tasha Jeans Dark Washed, Fountain Pen Revolution Blue Black, Lamy Blue, <coughs> sorry, kind of phlegmy today. Try something just really quick. Does that help? I'll try to diffuse the light a little bit. It didn't help, did it? What if I do that? That. Help at all? I can't tell. Well, we'll just have to work with it for now. I mean, have us your turquoise. <coughs> KWZ Hawaii Blue. Diamond Florida Blue. Robert Oster Lake of Fire. Monteverde Sapphire. Unicorn Blue. Aurora Blue. Monteverde Capri Blue. Noodlers Navajo Turquoise Twinkle. 10 BBS 385. Colorverse Cat. These are very similar. Nemesine Blue Snowball Nebula Twinkle. Birmingham Blizzard Twinkle. <clears throat> Monteverde Ice Cookie. Kyona Oto Hizoku. Robert Oster. Robert Oster Pacific Ocean Teal, Sailor Shiboku, Kyono um, Jerbong Kainite du Nepal, um, Diatramentus Co uh, Columbia Blue Copper. That's what I thought that this one would remind me of because it's got copper shimmer in it. Krishna Primary Blue, Monteverde Caribbean Blue, Carcos Turquoise, Pen BBS 386, Diatramentus Robert Louis Stevenson, Tasha Jeans Light Washed, Noodlers Midnight Blue, Diatramentus Steel Blue, Organic Studio Ralph Waldo Emerson Twilight Blue, Cross Blue, or 
Organics Studio Nitrogen, Roar and Klinger Koniglau, Diamine Bloody Brixit, Pure Pen Saltire, Diamine Skull and Roses, Twisby Midnight Blue, Jerobon Blue Pervinch, Freddy's Blue Vintage Blue Black, and Noodler's Navajo Turquoise. <coughs> I think I have enough blue inks. I, you never know. You never know when you're going to need a blue ink. You, just, you never know. You will find a time and that right circumstance. And somebody will say, hey, I'm looking for this blue with this gold shimmer or a blue with a silver shimmer or a blue with a turquoise overtone with pink highlight, you know, whatever. <sighs> There's always a need for some sort of blue ink. One second, I'll be right back. Okie dokie. Well. What do you guys think of this ink? Are you looking for a pretty coppery undertone blue with, uh, <clears throat> with some coppery gold shimmer? Maybe you'll give this one a try. Ferris wheel press timeless blue. I don't know how much they cost, but last time I checked, Ferris wheel press was kind of expensive. So, I don't know. Ha! <laughs> Jesus Christ on a bike. First we all press timeless blue. Um, there's no there's no information about this ink. I see one called Jelly Bean. That kind of looks like this one, but I don't know if it's that one or not. <coughs> oh, there it is. Timeless Blue. 38 mil bottle for $30. Huh. Wow. That's just a lot. That's the one. So, I hope that that was interesting to you. I hope that you learned something. Please share this video with your friends. Follow me on social media. 
and I will be back tomorrow with a Bujo sit-up video. I don't know what that is in Canadian. You'll have to do the math on Google. So, I will be back tomorrow with another video. So take care until then. Have a great day. Oh, love you. Bye.